Now, if you're not suitable for multi-vessel revascularization through the keyhole, either because the pattern of your heart disease is really very complex and you are better treated through the breastbone, or it might be that the CT scan has demonstrated that you've got a lot of furring up in the aorta pipe and therefore you would not be suitable for micropipes in the groin, then we can still sometimes perform keyhole treatment for you using hybrid revascularization. Now what does that mean? What it means is we take the best of surgery and the best of stents and put them together in the combined treatment strategy. And with the surgery we perform a small cut and we just do the one graft on the front of the heart, the lemur to the LAD. The lemur is the left internal mammary artery. It's on the back of the breastbone. We uh, dissect it down very carefully through the small cut and we literally plug it into the front of the heart. After that, maybe a few days later, or sometimes even on the same day, we will stent other areas of the heart artery problem to give you a complete revascularization strategy. And hybrid revascularization can be very effective in certain patients. So we always take the view that when a patient is keen on keyhole coronary surgery, we assess whether or not multivessel revascularization is the best plan for them, and we use a CT scan and look at the roadmap. If that's not suitable, can we perform hybrid and get an effective result? And if that's not suitable, then unfortunately, there is really only one treatment for you, and that is through the breastbone. And this spectrum of treatment strategies are spectrums that we have a lot of experience in at the Keyhole Heart Clinic. So if you want to know which of them is best for you, give us a call, and we look forward to trying to assess this for you. Bye for now.